A Halloween display, featuring a front yard full of tombstones, one for each of the victims in the Las Vegas massacre, was taken down Wednesday after it sparked some outrage online. The makeshift cemetery was spotted outside a house in North Vegas, with social media users posting pictures of it on Tuesday night. A large banner, with the words V. Gastrong on the front, was all that remained the next day, according to the Las Vegas Review Journal. While some were quick to blast the homeowners for the ghoulish decorations, most people have been sympathetic, with many referring to the display as a tribute rather than a stunt. Honestly, I don't think this person meant any disrespect to the victims since the V. Gastrong banner is there, wrote one Facebook user. It may be their attempt at honoring them. Their intentions may be a little misguided and in poor taste, but I don't think there is any maliciousness behind it. Another person added, WTF is wrong with people, it was a memorial. Not like he had dead bodies on the ground. People need to get a life. The Review Journal could not reach the owners of the home on Wednesday, but neighbors told the newspaper that they likely had the best intentions. I drive past this every day and when they first put it up, it touched my heart, said longtime resident Guy Becknell. If there's anybody that feels negative, I pray for you guys, because I feel very positive that the homeowners are giving honor to the people that were lost. Some social media users, however, admitted Wednesday that they could see why some would find the Halloween display disturbing. He could have just left the 58 flags as a memorial with the sign that would be okay, explained one Facebook user. Pretty sure their heart was in the right place with memorial, but to me, headstones are pretty ghoulish, especially with Halloween right around the corner, another said. Memorial headstones kind of spilled over into the holiday. I don't mind the crosses, hearts, rocks, balloons, angels, headstones, no.